Not enough people know about this beautiful fractal, the burning ship. The fractal is generated in the complex plane using this recursion. Zn plus 1 equals the absolute value of the components of Zn squared plus c. You let z0 equal 0 and let c be some complex number, and c is in the burning ship if and only if the sequence of Zn generated by the recursion stays bounded. For example, if c equals negative 1 half plus 1 half i, then the sequence goes 0, negative 1 half plus 1 half i, negative 1 half plus i, negative 5 fourths plus 3 halves i, and so on. This particular number ends up going to infinity, so it isn't in the set, but if I instead pick negative 1 half minus 1 half i, the sequence ends up bounded, so negative 1 half minus 1 half i is in the set. Note that in a lot of these visualizations, we're flipping the fractal upside down, because it looks nicer. Now, this fractal is really chaotic and asymmetric, seemingly much more so than the Mandelbrot set, which is generated with a similar looking recursion. This is because the recursion we're using is actually a really unnatural operation for complex numbers. In technical terms, it's not analytic, which makes it much, much harder to study. But just because it's weird doesn't mean it isn't really cool.